my name is Jim Bainey, as Lance said. I'm a partner at Schuler Shook in Chicago. And it's my privilege to introduce our next Lifetime Achievement Award winner tonight. Robert Shook, F-I-A-L-D and F-A-S-T-C, grew up in Louisville. I said that right, Bob? Louisville, Kentucky. <laughs> uh, he learned about his passion for lighting design from a high school teacher and mentor named Gene Strickler. Bob followed his passion for lighting and theater to Chicago and received his BFA from the Goodman School of Drama in theatrical lighting design and later his MFA from Ohio University in theater production. In 1986, along with Dwayne Schuler, Bob founded Schuler Shook, the firm that still bears his name to this day. Under Bob and Dwayne's leadership, Schuler Shook has grown to five offices in San Francisco Bay, Dallas, New York, Melbourne, Chicago, uh, and also Minneapolis. Schuler Shook's service offerings now include theater planning, architectural lighting design, and audio video design. Most of us in the room are familiar with our beloved unit of measure for, the luminous, for luminous intensity called the candela. The interesting thing about the candela is that it's referred to with both a magnitude and an associated direction. It seems to me that a lifetime achievement award measures one's ability to take many wise steps of a small magnitude in a strategic direction over a long period of time. These small steps come together to chart an overall trajectory for one's life and career. I'm grateful that my career intersected with Bob in 1994 when I joined Schuler Shook, and we've worked closely together ever since then. In 2014, I had the privilege to nominate Bob for fellow status in the IALD. At that time, I compiled a list of Bob's service and achievements, and let me tell you, the list was quite long. This evening, I could talk about Bob's multiple design awards for theatrical lighting design, architectural lighting design, or theater planning. I could mention Bob's numerous speaking and teaching engagements. I could list the industry committees that Bob has served on and led, and I could recount the many articles that he's authored. Each of these things contribute to why Bob is receiving this award tonight. Instead, I'd like to highlight some qualities that Bob possesses that typically doesn't show up on a CV or an awards application. Here are a few. Bob is a devoted husband. Bob and his lovely wife, Leslie, I found out today, have been married for 52 years. They, that's worth applauding, for sure. They share a love for the performing arts, as well as design and education. Until recently, Leslie served as the founding head of the BFA Theater Management Program at DePaul University. Together, Bob and Leslie make a strong and supportive team. Bob's a collaborator. Bob is a keen listener and understands that solutions to design problems can come from anyone in the room and sometimes from unexpected places. He understands that diverse backgrounds and disciplines lead to deeper team interactions and more interesting design solutions. Bob is a lifelong student. Bob has said that we learn from our experiences and that a lot of teaching happens on an informal basis in our everyday interactions. Bob believes that small deposits of knowledge and encouragement allow individuals to grow in their professional abilities over time. It's one of the reasons why Bob is such a big proponent of in-person, or at least hybrid, working <laughs> arrangements, where conversations over the partition wall, at the lunch table, or during an Uber ride to a job site can have long-lasting benefits. Bob is an educator and a mentor. Bob has always believed that it's his responsibility to generously share any special knowledge that he's been given along the path of his career with clients, colleagues, collaborators, and students. Bob is a creative designer. He's always pushed himself and all of us at Schuler Shook to look for creative ways to design, uh, to solve design problems. I have often heard Bob say, try doing something in a way that you've never tried before. Learn from what you've done in the past and use it as a foundation to create even better solutions going forward. Bob is a wise and consistent leader. Bob's legacy of leadership lives on at Schuler Shook and in the many individuals he's mentored over the years. To this day, when we reach a particularly challenging direct decision, sorry, at Schuler Shook, I often find myself thinking, what would Bob Shook do? And of course, when we can't figure out the answer to that question, we just give him a call and we ask. 
or a team's message or whatever else uh, we, we choose to use. And he gives us sage advice. That is unless he's on the pickleball court, in which case all bets are off. <laughs> As an example of Bob's leadership, when it came time for Bob to retire, he and Dwayne proposed proactive transition plans that, al that allowed the company to continue to grow and to flourish. My last point, finally, Bob is concise. When it came to each year to write our awards applications for IALD and IES, we often took the first pass at writing the text. When we had banged our head against the wall trying to boil the important details of a three-year-long lighting project down into 300 words or less, we handed it off to Bob, and within a few minutes he had modified it to say exactly what we wanted to say, but with far fewer words. So in the spirit of conciseness, I will stop the heron. It's my honor to introduce Robert Shook, recipient of the Edison Report Lifetime Achievement Award. Thank you, Jim. Thanks to uh, Edison Report for this, uh, for this great honor. Uh, I have to say that I, I need to share this honor with all the incredible lighting designers that I've had the pleasure of collaborating with over all the years uh, that I've been doing this. Uh, all really creative, great individuals. And uh, as Jim said, I, I love the collaborative process. They've uh, pretty much kept me from running amok, so. <laughs> um, also, I'd like to thank uh, uh, and honor the manu lighting manufacturers who give us such great tools uh, to work with, and the reps uh, who are, you know, a fantastic resource for us with when we're designing and during construction. Uh, the, the reps mean a lot to us, and the manufacturers mean a lot to us. So uh, uh, all that group together, big thank you, and thank you for being here. <laughs>